As we're underway from a sunny city stadium, the kickers and the hailstorm. Very contrasting out. Hit Rob Cornwall. And now here comes Richmond again. Tozaki on the right side with a blast. Heat seeking missile just flies by the top corner of Johan Penyaranda's goal. Rogers. He's gonna have, oh, I thought he was gonna have a go from distance. Stone's gonna lay it back to Luke Kitch. He's got some space with the right foot. Good save low by Akira. Didn't have to go too far for it. Back to Norman. He's now got to be careful. It's not the kind of challenge you want after receiving the yellow card. This could be trouble for Destin Norman. And he's done. Oh my, Destin Norman with two yellow cards in the space of as many minutes and the Hailstorm are down to 10 men. Okay, here's a look at the second one. Perhaps we can slow it down for you. Norman got the ball, that's harsh. Finds Bryant. Payne. Tozagi swings it in. Good save in the end by Penaranda. I didn't see quite who got the touch on it. At least until Eamon Zayek can get to the locker room and work on his tactics. Here's Bentley with some space down the right. Well crossed in for Vignoles, and it's one now! That's what the Hailstorm didn't want to have happen. As the Spaniard scores his third goal of the season. On the Greenswell Glorious replay, Matt Bentley pulls it back and Vignoles with a fine finish. That wasn't an easy one. Hopped up a little bit on him. Vignoles with a great strike. No Hailstorm players close enough to put him up. Those guys didn't even make the 18 over the last couple of games due to some tactical decisions. This one's pulled back. Bolaños with this shot. Blocked out in front. Terzaghi! His fifth of the season. Leans up the mess in the box and gives the kickers a 2-0 lead here in Richmond. The kicker scored twice here in the last five minutes before the break. Here's another look at it here. Bolaños, shot was blocked initially. Tozagi was there to pounce. And that man's not going to miss from that distance. Just pokes the ball past a despairing Penaranda. This is the Hailstorm's seventh away game of the season. They've only played two home games. Well traveled team so far. Here's the delivery from Vinya. Oh, so it's too close to Penaranda. Not sure if he got there. It looked like Trisler got there first, but just couldn't get enough of his head on it. Going to help set up a third, and that's going to be a penalty. No, referee's going to say contact was outside the box. Matt Bentley disagrees with the decision. The yellow card has been brandished. Looks like it will go to Leo Fola. This will grow as replay. Let's see where the contact. Yeah, the contact perhaps was just outside the box. Certainly deserving of a yellow card. Vinyals. Off the post and almost inside the other post. Oh my. Vignal's itches away from making it 3 0. Rogers will take it. Right footed. Looking to try and get his team in, back into this one at the halfway mark of the second half. A good delivery. Hernandez is there. And it's in. I wasn't sure if it hit the side netting. But the Hailstorm are right back in this one via the set piece. We got a little bit of shenanigans going on between Chrysler and Aman as Hailstorm wanted to get the ball right back. Take another look at it here on the Greenville Growers replay. Yeah, Cuomo was there, got his foot to it, just ahead of Bentley. At the edge of the six yard box, left footed finish. It's a nice one by a center back. Fitzgerald with no chance. Payne from his forward, left back, right back position, excuse me. Owen Gordon with the cross, falls all the way through and in! Jonathan Bolaños beat Owen down to it. Put the ball back across the goal and passed Johan Pernaranda as the kickers get their two goal lead back. Gordon with far too much space on that side and <laughs> I'm not sure if Bolaños, he didn't really kick it, he just sort of leaned into it. He may have been fouled by Owen Dam on the way. Played a decent amount in 2020, not a whole lot last year either. By Mike. Right, Gordon, tons of space on the right. Gordon now with the right footed shot right at Penaranda. 
Didn't have to do much, did the goalie. Six corners, two, two in favor of the home side. Let's see the one stat that matters, three goals to one. Bologna slips it through. Stephen Payne with a cutback and the, oh, what a save by Ben Yorando, are you joking? How did he keep that one out? So it's Rogers as well as Lukic. Lukic will chip it in. Looking for the back post, finds it, and it's 3-2. Another set-piece goal fr straight from the training ground and worked perfectly. And it's Leo Fola with the assist from his fellow centre-back, Rob Cornwall. Tied things up. Everybody forgot about Leo Fola. But the back post was a lovely header back. Excuse me, they forgot about Cornwall. It was a lovely header back across. So Cornwall with a goal and an assist tonight. Trying to get back on track. They've really struggled since getting the first place in USC Week 1. And that will do it from Richmond. A fun contest here to open Week 12 in USL League 1.